Hey guys, welcome back. And in this video, we're gonna talk about how to fix your USB headset. Stay tuned. Hey guys, welcome back to another video. And in this video, I'm gonna show you how you can fix your USB headset if there's a problem going on with it. Uh, mine, basically, whenever I join into a Discord channel, or voice channel, uh, it would turn off. Well, not turn off, it would still be turned on, but it would disconnect, disconnect, disconnect and disconnect and it would basically be disconnecting and then reconnecting so it would be non-stop disconnecting and then again it would uh, reconnect and I was getting really frustrated I thought it was the headset because I was like why isn't this working well uh, I found I found out that it was actually the power settings of the computer where it was telling it to save energy so it was basically not giving it enough energy to the USB port to power up the the headset completely so i'm actually going to be showing you in this video how you can actually change the options in the usb ports so that way uh the power doesn't cut off whenever you're trying to join a usb sorry uh, <laughs> whenever you're trying to join a discord server uh voice channel so that way you can talk to people uh, you might also have problems with other services such as Skype and this might actually fix it for you. Um, so before we get further down, let's go ahead and go into the options like I told you what we're going to do. Uh, we're going to go here and instead of typing anything, we're going to type power option. Okay, and then we're right here where it says edit power plan. We're going to click on that and then we're gonna have this window come up. We're not gonna move anything here. We're just gonna to go to change advanced power settings. Click on here and then just minimize this so you don't get confused. Uh, we're gonna look for the USB settings, which is right here. The, in the USB settings, you're gonna open that and then open this again. And then here is by default, it's gonna be enabled. I had to disable mine because like I said, that was the only way to get my headset working. So you're gonna click here, click disable, and then click disable for this. And you're basically telling the computer, uh, even though when you're charging or not charging, I do not want you to turn off or reduce power to the USB settings. So that way, if you have a wireless headset or a regular headset or you know any other device that might not be working correctly, uh, the power to the USB isn't gonna go down. All right, so we're gonna hit okay on that. Now, normally that helps and that solves the issue, but if it's still going on, what you can do is gonna be the second option that I'm gonna show you. So we're gonna close this window here, and then we're gonna go over here, and we're gonna click on, I'm sorry, we're gonna type device manager, and you can click on it without typing the whole thing if you wanted to. And here, I'm gonna minimize these so you can see where it's gonna be. Um, where we're gonna to go to is right here in the middle where it says human interface devices. We're gonna click this so we can uncollapse. And then we're gonna go all the way down to the list where it says USB input device. Now, it might be in a different location for you, but this is where you wanna, the option that you're gonna to wanna to change the options for. Uh, we're gonna do all three of them. Now you may have more depending if you have more USB ports on your computer. Uh, I'm on the laptop right now, but you, this works for a desktop as well. So what we're gonna do here is click on it, right click properties, and then power management. And then this right here is gonna be checked by default. We're gonna unclick it. So that way we're telling also the computer in another place, we're gonna be telling it don't suspend power or try to save power for this USB port. Okay, so we're gonna hit yet, okay. And then we're gonna do that for the other two. Right click, allow to computer turn off, okay. And then the last one, right click, properties, power management, and then uncheck it and hit okay. Okay, and then you can close this out. You can then try and go into Discord or any other uh, program that uses your headset like Skype or uh, in-game uh, voice chat service, anything like that, try it. And if it doesn't work, restart it. So that way the the settings can uh, take an effect in case they, they weren't. And if these two options didn't work after uh, you tried everything, and if the driver's updated and the USBs are charged or the connection's not ripped, 
then at that point I would go ahead and return the headset and get a new one because uh, it seems that it might be the headset and not the the actual computer but like I said if it worked for you hit that thumbs like and if it didn't work for you uh, or if it did work for you you know put that comment in the comment section don't forget to subscribe and hit that bell icon because I want to be doing more of these videos and if there's a problem that you're trying to figure out for some of your things uh, go ahead and also put it in the comment section because I like solving problems basically troubleshooting things um, I can basically work on something for like five days before giving up <laughs> so all right guys well have a great day and thank you again see ya